I know what you're thinking, punk. You're thinking, did he fire six shots or only five? Now, to tell you the truth, I forgot myself and all this excitement. But being this is a 44 Magnum, the most powerful handgun in the world, and will blow your head clean off, you've got to ask yourself a question. Do I feel lucky? Well, do you, punk? On the left. Hello, hello, hello baby. Welcome to another Monday here in the Five Awesome Bears. And I want to take the time right now and say happy birthday to you. Happy birthday to you, Mr. Friday Bear. I'm sorry I didn't mention anything last week video because last week's video was had a purpose and um, no one else commented throughout the week about, you know, what had happened. But, you know, whatever, past is the past. I'm not going to be dwelling on none of that. Uh, I do want to take the time and ask you, New Bear, please respect. That's all I'm going to ask. You know, past is a past. Let's take it from now on. It's all I'm going to ask. So, yeah. Other than that, let's get to the questions this week because there's not, not many in this. The challenge, which for me was a nightmare to do because I'm not a dancer. I really am not a dancer. I suck at dancing like really, really, really bad. But um, with enough further ado, let's get to the questions and challenges this week. So, booyah! Okay, so our Tuesday bear Joe, he asked us boxers or briefs, so I'm gonna show you. Mr. Wednesday, here we go. Shake, shake, shake. Shake, shake, shake. Okay, so Thursday Bear, he asked us about a favorite toy when we were little kids, and um, I didn't have many toys when I was a little kid. I I don't know, I had a skateboard, and, and I, I share, shared that for a while. Um, but like growing up, I would have to say, early teens, I would have to say, I love Power Rangers. Uh, when they came out, I was such a big fan, along with my brother, and um, little by little, family members and my mom were able to buy me. Um, toys, Power Ranger toys, and since then I've been collecting them. And this is the latest one. I actually bought this one about a month ago. And amazing, amazing. I keep collecting them. They're so cool. This is the original, original Power Rangers. Yeah. So, yeah, I have to say Power Rangers, and I'm guilty of that. And I still collect them, and I have bunches of them and I could buy them find them and I wish I had a little aquarium so I can put them all on display but I have no not much space in my house so yeah I can't do that but yeah that's um I have to say favorite toys I guess okay and finally Friday bear he asked us um, about um, the birthday gift and during birthday gift and um, I have two of them, one of them, and, and, and all of them being by my friend Raul, by the way. Um, I got a lava lamp, and it's very relaxing. I don't know why. I can definitely sit down in my living room and, and just relax, just look at it, and just wander off. I don't know. It's just very, very um, relaxing for me. And the second gift is actually my iPod charger slash boombox, which, you know, a little boombox. And um, it's awesome. I can just put my iPod to charge and listen to it at the same time, and... I love that. I mean, I use that almost every day and charge my iPod and I listen to it. I just love it. Thank you, Raul. Thank you. Thank you. It's, it's, it's amazing. So, yeah, those are my birthday gifts. Yeah. Yeah, other than that, you guys, my question, yeah, is what is uh, the show that you're looking forward to see this summer now that most of the shows are over, lost? I'm still crying about it, god damn it. I, I love Lost. I, I'm gonna miss Lost so much. So um I'm looking forward to see Big Brother this summer. If you have not seen Big Brother, please let's start watching Big Brother now because it's gonna be awesome. It's gonna be I think it's gonna be July 8th it starts. So yeah, I really can't wait for that. I'm I'm like, an, an excited, energetic, I don't know what to say. I'm like <laughs> 
I, I love Big Brother, you guys. It, it, it's amazing. So, what is the show that you are looking forward to see this summer? Yeah. Bye bye. Best known for his many fans for the one of the most memorable screen incarnations, San Francisco Police Inspector Dirty Harry Callahan, the actor and Oscar-winning filmmaker Clint Eastwood, is born on this day in 1930 in San Francisco, California. With his father, Eastwood wandered the West Coast as a boy during the Depression. Then, after four years in the Army Special Services, Eastwood went to Hollywood where he got his start in a string of B-movies. For eight years, Eastwood played Rowdy Yates in a popular TV western series, Rawhide, before emerging as a leading man in a string of low-budget spaghetti western directed by Sergio Leone, Fistful of Dollars, 1964, For a Few Dollar More, 1965, and The Good, The Bad, and The Ugly in 1966. All three were successful but Eastwood made his own breakthrough with the 1971 smash hit Very Harry, directed by Don Siegel. Though he was not the first choice to play the film's title role, Frank Sinatra, Stephen McQueen, and Paul Newman all reportedly declined the part. Eastwood made it his own, turning the blunt, cynical Dirty Harry into an iconic figure in the American film. <laughs> 